Hi everybody, we're gonna do a QA. and a um, So we are answering viewers' questions. And we have a question from Mr. Monster. And his question is, what is the best sport jacket for late spring, summer, when I already have a lot of blue jackets with no pattern? I want something versatile, but it seems like blue is the only choice. Maybe with a pattern next time, but which one? All right, so let's break this question down. Firstly, um, you want something for late spring, summer. So it means you're not really wearing it to keep warm. You know, if anything, you kind of want to wear something that's got a lot of color, it's airy, it's breathable, because it's going to be hot by this time of year. Um, you've already got your navies, which is fine. Uh, there's plenty of other options after that. Uh, I would suggest, the first place I would go after navy jacket is actually to like the pale, pale browns or even the ivories. I really like these sorts of colors in the summer. So I'm talking about like this set here. This is from Laura Piana. It's the Proposto Abiti and Proposto Jacque for 2024. Um, and you know, despite like this being for suiting, I think actually it still could work very nicely just as a jacket alone. Otherwise, like going a little bit darker into these slightly more saturated shades of brown and taupe, I think that works really well. I would also <clears throat> look into the world of green. So going to the world of green, uh, these two very heavily patterned options from Laura Piana are great. Laura Piana always has a great palette and a great taste for pattern. Um, but I would also look to our friends in France at Maison Hellard. And Maison Hellard has some lovely options if you don't mind something that is a little bit on the soft side um, and definitely a little bit more wrinkly, but very expressive. I would say these two, or even just the plain like that. If you don't have a green jacket in this sort of shade, it's well worth considering. Where else could you go after that? Uh, well, our friends at VBC always have you covered. Um, this is actually from the Armory's Discernment Bunch. So the Discernment Bunch is kind of our summary of all the, all the uh, must-haves um, in the VBC bunches. Oh, sorry, in the, in the VBC Drapper's bunches. So I will go back to brown. This is a lovely shade of kind of charcoal brown. You know, very dark, but with enough brown in it to be interesting. Or I would go back here, something much lighter and fresher. And this is their Hopsack Weave. It's very cool. You said you already have blues, but I do love this, this shade of baby blue. I wear this sort of color a lot and I really like it in the summer. And here we are back again to that kind of pale ivory, taupe, oatmeal, whatever you want to call it. Finally, um, our friends at Fox. Fox Brothers also has a wonderful palette, a lot of interesting things. They have a book called Fox Linens, and if you are really thinking about green, there's actually several interesting greens in there. So there's this olive drab, and then this more like a true olive to me, and then even a dark olive, which is verging on a gray or a brown. I love those three. And if you want patterns, I love fox patterns. This is the Fox Journey book. It's 100% wool. Um, there's a few things in here. If you were going to wear a lot of jeans or white trousers, I do like this. Just gray and blue, like with a pair of jeans, this would look great, or with a pair of white trousers, this would look really strong as well. Um, and maybe even something a little bit cream uh, or a little bit, or very dark charcoal. But I'm super into that pattern. Otherwise, the brown variation of it is wonderful. And I also want to show you this, just because I think it's so cool. Plus, if you want to look at a few blues, that sort of stuff is great, too. All right, so I hope that gave you a few ideas for what you could do with your late spring summer jacket. Um, I hope this also gets you guys thinking about what you're going to do with your wardrobes, because you are already a little bit late as I am as well. If you want to put in the custom order, um, and of course you're always welcome to do so at the Armory, uh, this would be the time, uh, because otherwise we're not going to make it in time for summer. All right, that's it for now, and thanks for watching.